in empty times. I hope y'all can hear me over my air purifier, but let's get started. Thousand Wishes hand sanitizer spray. I have that one in my car. I got done with that. My sea salt and lime hand soap. That is all done for. Chill lime, fresh eucalyptus, and sea salt. I paired that with the ginger lime twist that was heavily underrated i don't think it was underrated i think it just was hidden in that candle day 2022 package you know how they brought out the cotton coconut the toast of pistachio vanilla like this line with um the pink leather rose i felt like it needed its own springtime theme i felt like this didn't get enough love so it kind of was overlooked Body care mist done for the white citrus. We are all done. That little bit in there, I was ready to kill it. Uh, life of the party, I was done. Remember on my empties two weeks ago, I brought you all the shower gels and the lotions for these. Done them all up. I like to cocktail my fragrances and go ahead and get through your fragrances. This Opal House Cozy Nights from Target. I couldn't even tell you what it was supposed to smell like. I ended up putting it on the warmer or loaded in the bathroom as a nightlight when I took my bath at night. It smelled like nothing to me. Put it on the warmer, still smelled like nothing. Nonetheless, it's done. And the way these two wicks are placed, you would think they're perfect, but it was hard to pull out, which means it wasn't wicked high enough. But it is what it is. Red, white, and blue cake. I love this candle. Cynthia, please send me some more. Red raspberry, ripe blueberry, whipped vanilla cream. It smells like a strawberry shortcake, almost. More like a like a butter cake. No, I take that back. Like a white cake. Like a white cake that you put some fresh vanilla whipped cream on. And the strawberries and the blueberries has macerated. And you put them on top of the cake. I think this is the third one of this candle that I finished. Cynthia's store, theirs went MOS. And I wish I had some more. Um, my bag, girl, that I just finished last night, Ebony Sands. This is the Warm Tonka. You have the Ebony Woods Tobacco Flower. Batty, batty. A low on the adult side. So, again, I don't think everybody got the just of that candle. You got the watermelon mint eucalyptus. I thought I was going to take this to the beach with me, but I ended up finished. Uh, the, the watermelon lemonade eucalyptus mint. You all... Uh, watermelon mint mojito. I don't know how else to describe it. Not only that, it had me burning fresh balsam oil along with watermelon uh, lemonade oil in the house the past two days. All a vibe. Um, I want to come to y'all on a try it Tuesday with this one because I've never burnt island papaya, believe it or not. And I got this one out MOS. It had no scent, but that's because, uh, you know, cashiers don't know to check for candles that have been warmed. So I do have a new one. I'm going to bring you all to try it too because I've never tried this candle before. Well, this real luscious scent combination, the, uh, they call it a pound cake. I'm still going to say just a, a fluffy cake, like a fluffy cake, not a pound cake with uh, the berries and the whipped vanilla, like a short cake. And I paired it with the iced lemon pound. You couldn't tell me a strawberry lemonade cake wasn't being baked in my home, you all. This is the only reason why I picked up this scent is so I can have a blending combination. And this set it off. And then look at red, white, and blue cake back there. So y'all know gourmands is the last thing that I touch. But when I'm in the mood for it, this is why I always tell people I burn off of my mood. The marshmallow fireside black cherry merlot. Um, I liked it. I didn't love it. I liked it for a small room because that's where it performed best. You all, I have reviews on just about all of these. Uh, Island Margarita Vanilla Bean. You know, I like this candle. When I said that on my review, I liked it. Um, in my open concept, she did she did okay. She's not as strong as the original Alamar, but that's to be expected because Vanilla Bean is in it. So a sweet treat twist to Island Margarita. That one performed pretty darn good. And then this right here, I lost the whole wick. Now, how did this happen? The wick separated from the wick holder, put it on the warmer, and just finish it off. Now, off top, the throw was throwing. The throw was very nice, but the wicks wouldn't stand up, and I got tired of playing with it. And you know what? All these, um, you get what you pay for. 
down here you have a blueberry marshmallow bar that i did finish up again i was in a gourmand mood uh the marshmallow cereal bar with blueberry that's what i call it because it does smell like it's a like a like a cereal note that's tied up in there but this one was a 10 across the board in my open concept it kicked nicely and white gardenia tiki beach i know y'all like diva you finished with all these blends already yeah 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 the white gardenia tiki beach um anybody that can handle the floral of white gardenia on its own this was the perfect combination actually this one did good i wouldn't be surprised to see this one come back and they remove the rose water ivy uh mahogany teak wood because the throw i don't know how to throw on that was this year but last year blends volume one it was not good and then random wallflowers i believe i'm not even gonna lie to y'all because i tell y'all i'll be in the house and the wallflower plugs be empty like that one right there um and i'll just change it when i see fit and then swan's creek i broke down and got one of their candles this was the afternoon rain cotton rain in my bathroom in my beauty cave actually i all i call it now the candle glam cellar did amazing and burnt clean okay swan creek another gourmand mood the orange buttercream cupcake wax melts i am totally done for and i think that was like six wallflower plugs all together so i made this one quick because recycling is at the door uh 14 candles somebody here later i have a dedicated review on half of all of these so check out my playlist that says candle love i'm gonna link it above and time to recycle and head out the door Bye, y'all.